Good morning, morning everybody. Are you selling Today's my day off. off. Tomorrow too. Are you selling I'm just Are you working on crops? stuff for the channel and getting caught up on blogs. I've seen in my life. That's DLV. Danny, Danny and Lindsay. The weather's really nice. As you can see. So I'll probably be taking a walk. Later I'm going to be coloring my hair because I've had gray since I was 17 and I'm just not ready to surrender to that. So, yep, good morning everybody. Okay, we've caught up on quite a bit of the DLV, not all of them yet though. And then I have to get finish getting caught up on Charles, CTFXE, and then catch up on Travis, which there aren't as many of those as there is the other two guys. Then I have to watch Elijah Elfo and PVP, and I want to start watching Dude Like Hella again, Corey Williams. We'll get all that stuff caught up and get it so that there's only the new ones to watch every day. I can't believe I fell so far behind, like two months behind. I don't like missing any of them. How are you feeling today? Sore. From what? Holding the chair down. Okay. Yeah? Yeah, that'll make you nice and sore. Yeah. Called sore assitis. Yeah, I guess. You gotta go out and do something. So I just sat here and hold the chair down and I have my ass get wider and wider. Well, after I eat my baked potato for lunch, we're gonna go see if there's a, a used toilet behind your brother's house. So yeah, there's that at least. Right. And if there ain't one there, we can go down to uh, my friend Don's house and see if there's one down there. Yeah. Because his is get because he's ripping his old house trailer down and everything. There ain't much of that left. So I know if he doesn't. No one gets those additions down there. I'm going to be going. I'm going to see if I can get them. Yeah. And if we can't find a used toilet, when the taxes come, I am buying a new one from Home Depot. They're less than a hundred dollars, and then everything will be back to normal here, because the water lines are all fixed. A long time ago, we got the the water line under the house thawed. Then everything will be back the way it should be, which will be nice. We're at Dave and Nikki's and these are their bunnies. You like their you like their bedding down? Yeah. There's uh, another one over here. <laughs> another one? Yeah. Yeah, hopefully she's pregnant too. Yeah, We'll get some. We we already got rabbit pens, so Oh, yeah. Do a little bit of work to them. I'm sure there'll be all huh. kinds of bunnies hopping around here this summer. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hopefully, make good food. The with pepper right now. Yeah, I told him. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, we're gonna go for a little walk out back. All right. There's still okay deep snow back there. Is there? Okay deep snow. Yeah, well, it all depends on where you're at. So yeah, they live next door to horses. More out back here too. Yeah, you can see them back there. And we're heading to the back, back there to try to find a used toilet that's supposed to be laying back there. So we'll see what happens. Hopefully you can find one. I know there used to be uh, at least two of them laying around, but it's hard to say if they're still around or not. Yeah. Do you bite? Do you? Do you bite? You better not bite. I got bit by one, my Uncle Richard's horse when I was a teenager, so you better not bite. What a fluffy horse. Huh. Cute. There's some more horses back there. So that's kind of cool. No luck? All broken? Uh, both of them are broke. Just them both. That sucks. Yeah, that's the pony that was born last year, the last yeah. summer. I thought it was kind of young. Yeah, it was just born last summer. Huh. 
some more horses. You said the black and white one's the mom? Yeah, I believe it's the mom is the black and white one. To I'm this leaving. pony here. This pony. Yep, this pony's not even a year old. Lots of horses here. Oh, yeah. I think there's close to 20 of them all together. Wow. But I know they rent, rent their horses out. Last I knew, they had some rented out to the Mackinac Island. Yeah, that makes sense. We're pretty close. Oh! <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> I touched the electric fence. <laughs> <laughs> you touched the electric fence? Yeah. <laughs> Kick your ass? Yeah, it touched up my leg. It went through me and went down. Well, you gotta pay attention. <laughs> Why don't you try pissing at it? <laughs> I told you it was alive. I didn't know I was gonna touch it. <laughs> Made made the pony jump too. <laughs> yeah. The pony probably felt it too. I know it went right through my hand. I felt it. <laughs> Did it? Poor horse. <laughs> yeah. Trying to beat up on their baby pony, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. The the pony's looking at you. Like Sorry. bet me. Sorry. Bet me to make up for it. <laughs> but yeah, the pony here is not even a year old. I'm not sure what month it was born, but. It'll be sometime this summer, that'll be a year. Huh. But I know they got a lot of horses here. Oh, no one coming up, wanting attention, looks like. They do got a lot of really pretty horses here. The electric fence running in through right there. Maybe we can get this white one to come up over here, maybe. Hard to say. Come up, we'll come back a little bit further to get the miniature ponies for you. I don't think the white one's going to come over. Hard to say. But they got a lot of horses here. Yeah, yep. they might be coming. Maybe. Like, fuck you, I'm taking a shit. <laughs> I know they seem fence. to only go in a certain place. It's not everywhere. Yeah. But, yeah, I know they got some nice horses. Kind of cool having them right next door down here. Yeah. But, I want to get the Oh, there's one ponies. right down here. Yeah, these, these are their miniature horses. They got three of them. It smells like Mackinac Island here. <laughs> yeah. All we need is a smell of fudge. Definitely. These are their miniature ponies. Yeah, this is one of the bigger versions of the pony of the miniatures. Then right there is the smaller version, the uh, 30 inch I think they're called. Oh yeah, really short legs on that one, wow. Yeah. <laughs> but you only can let little, like really little young kids ride on these guys here because of the fact that they can't handle a lot of weight because of their size. Yeah. But I kind of like this one here just because look at his face. Yeah. But we'll be getting you guys footage like this every now and then because of the fact that, well, they're right next to the, right next door on the family property. Yeah, and right now we are on Don's other property, so he owns two things of property. Yeah, it's just that my name's not on this one here because of the way the Social Security Board is that I'm not allowed to have more than one chunk of land in my name because they use it against you if you do. So it's just in my brother's names. But if something ever happens to the other property and needs somewhere to go, then this is where I'd move to, to, well, where we would move to if something was ever happened to the other property. Well, I know there ain't no toilets even further out back. We're approximately about four acres back. Yeah, so we're gonna, where are we going to go to check for another one? Uh, just down the road here at one of my friend's, friend's house. His name is also Don and look and see there, and see if there's a toilet there. Yeah, and then that's it, that's the only place to look, right? Yeah. 
Okay, then if we don't find anything, that means I'm definitely buying one. Yeah, if there ain't one down there, then that means we're forced to have to buy one. Yeah, at least they're not as expensive as I thought they would be. Mm, no. So I'm standing here with my whole, from my shoulder all the way to my hand. It hurts because I touched the electric fence. Boy, I'm stupid, huh? <laughs> we're at Don's friend's house now, and he's heading way back in there to check for a toilet back there. I'm staying in the car because my feet are already wet from walking by the horses and I know that snow is wet because the weather's better and it's warm and it's melting. And this is his friend's house. That's where we are. We're only down the road from Dave and Nikki's. So I hope he finds one, but if he doesn't, I'm going to buy one. Not today, but after the tax, my tax return comes. So we definitely lucked out. He didn't find one back in there, but we just stopped at this place. Back street outlet. Yeah, and the guy is luckily open, and he's got one in there, and he's gonna give it to give it to us for 15. So we're gonna go to the ATM machine and get money off my card, and we're gonna get it. So this definitely solves a big problem. And then after that, we're gonna go to Dairy Queen because I haven't been there in about four years. So instead of Dairy Queen, we decided on Woodwinds. I've never been in here, and Don's surprised by that. I'll get some real food. We want some real food. Yeah, I just can't believe have never been in here. It's one of my restaurants I really like to go to. Nope, yeah. never ever been in here. I was in here this last summer and had a hot roast beef sandwich with uh, fries with gravy over top of them. Oh yeah? Ooh, one of my favorites. <laughs> well, it's pretty nice in here. And I got a salad and some soup. I'm getting the chicken dinner. What did you get? A hot roast beef sandwich instead of uh, mashed potatoes with fries with gravy over top. So yeah, this is a one-time thing, a rare treat, but I'm really hungry, so I'm going to eat this now. So here's Don's. It looks really good. And here's mine. I haven't had anything like this in well over a year, so it's not going to hurt one time, and I'm riding the bike tonight. So. <laughs> Okay, dinner was great, and then we come out we've got this. <laughs> I've, I always see this here. Keep your in the mouth. I promise you'll only bite really hard. Oh, sure. But yeah, I highly recommend this place if you're ever in Onaway, Michigan. It's really good food, really good service. I really enjoyed it, and believe it or not, growing up here, I never went in there. I didn't realize you were still outside when we left. Have you had enough outside time? You goofy cat. You been out enough? No. We'll let you in and one minute later you'll turn around and meow at the door. Let me back out. Let me back out. Right? You goofy cat. Well, now we can get the toilet fixed anyway. So what's on tap for tonight is that we're going to watch Guardians of the Galaxy on Blu-ray. I uh, saw that Family Dollar has a red box, and I've never rented from one before. So I decided to try it. Because there are no video stores in Onaway at all. Um, I missed Family Video, but it was only $2 to rent the movie, and it's 3.50 to rent a Blu-ray at Family Video, so that was cheaper. I, it's a great movie. I'm sure most of you know that. I saw it in the theater this fall alone, and Don's never seen it, so I think he'll like it. When I was at Family Dollar, I got this. I think I'll put it up there, above the kitchen window, because there's nothing up there. It's inspirational, which I like inspirational things. And it has a butterfly, which reminds me of my Aunt Kathy my mom's sister who unfortunately was killed in a car accident in 1997 and we miss her really bad and she loved butterflies so most of us now have a thing for butterflies Don's starting to get the the new toilet all cleaned up and ready he's gonna fix that so it's been a good day so far well that's interesting I just vacuumed and my vacuum decided to explode it still works, so I guess. The bag's not full, so I don't know why that happened. Maybe it was just getting weak and it started to crack before and I didn't notice. I don't know. But at least it still works. 
I guess I shouldn't be surprised because the thing's probably going on 20 years old by now. Oh well. Well, now we have a toilet, and the bathroom is complete and normal, along with my fishes. And I just uh, ordered a Roku remote for the Roku in the bedroom so that I can actually use it because in July the ceiling collapsed in my apartment because they had too much balloon and insulation up there and all they had holding the ceiling drywall up was nails instead of screws and they ended up losing my Roku remote so I finally found a replacement and ordered that so that'll come in the mail soon and Don and I just got all my extra stuff out of the extra room and put it in the shed outside instead because there wasn't enough room for it well, I colored my hair tonight, as you can tell. It came out really dark. It's wet now, so I don't know how dark it'll be when it dries. It wasn't supposed to be black, but it kind of looks black. And we've been watching Guardian, Guardians of the Galaxy, but Don's getting too tired, so we pause it and we'll finish it tomorrow. What do you think of it so far? Uh, sorry. That's it? It's all right? Yeah, that's well, it. Well, you I guess you're not going to know until we get to the, till we get all the way to the end. Oh yeah. You, you your full opinion won't be there until we you see it all. <laughs> all right. But we're going to go ahead and say good night and we hope that you enjoyed the video and that you subscribe, like, comment, share and that you're having a great day. Good night everybody. See you in the morning. Flint. Were you going to make me do that? <laughs> Alright, bye.